What are you making for your science project? Microbial fuel cell. Grandma, it's me. I'm just making my science project. And for my science project, I'm making a microbial fuel cell. I have to measure this thing. Okay. Then that'd be right there. Ah. Ah. That could have been easier. Gotta measure it halfway. Okay, I'm gonna drill a hole. Dad has to hold it. Now, now let it keep going. Yep. Okay. It didn't yeah, fail. The other one. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of pressure. <laughs> Literally. All right, let's do this one. Okay. I gotta peel it off. Peel off that little stuff. Yeah. That smells good. Here, here's this one. Give you that one too. Okay. That is like enough. Taking a picture. Taking a video. Okay. Take a picture for a science fair project. Sludge. Ew. Sludge. Gross. Yeah, that's enough filming. Alright, this is like really heavy. Oh! Hand came under that bar. Got it. That. If you don't know what I'm cutting, I'm cutting aluminum mesh. Ugh. It's not sticking to aluminum. Stop it. Ooh. Ooh. Not sticking. Okay, I have to fold this until it gets one more smaller than this. That's part of the science project. Okay, now that's folded. We have to get this. We gotta kind of, we twisted it before, but now we have to, Dad, did you do the same thing? No, other side, just do the oh, other side. Oh, other side. Okay, well, sorry about that. We're gonna have to kind of fan it out when I'm twisting it. Right. I'm gonna fan it out. I'm gonna take the middle of this. Is that the middle? Or is that no, the middle? And then we're gonna kind of stick it in there so I can get a little better grip. And shut it. We are going to get paper clip. 
going to take it apart so that it's okay, we'll get another one. We're going to get another paper clip. <laughs> this time it hopefully doesn't break. We're going to hold that to make sure. We're going to wrap it around this so it's nice and tight. That's what these paper clips are for. They're not meant for sitting around. Okay. Oopsies. Oh my crap. Whoa. Okay. Now we have to put one of these in each. Just gotta get that through the hole. There we go. And now just slide the top on so that we can put our sludge and water in there in a minute. Another one in here. We cracked it, but I don't think that matters because all we have to do is oops, slip it through. So now We've built it. I guess all we have to do is fill it up with sludge and water and then leave a little hole for the water when so that water can, I mean, air can get in. The sludge, we don't put an extra hole. Excuse me. Switch spots for a second. Okay, now I got a better point of view so I can put this stuff that makes things waterproof. Don't wanna mess that up. This is sludge, also known as ocean mud. And we got this from both Satika wetlands when we weren't supposed to be there. But anyway, um, I'm just mixing it up so when we Put the sludge inside of that container right there, dead jump. We finished. We will. It will be perfect and nice sludge. Hello, and finally, the moment at least I've been waiting for has come. Putting sludge inside of that. Not much water, but mostly sludge. Yeah. All right. Here we go. But it's kind of heavy. Trying not to get a lot of water. Okay, I'll get the rest of that. Here we go. Okay. More? Make sure not to get the water in there, Dad. This. Okay. Okay, get the get a little bit of like the watery stuff. Deep down. Hold We're on. back, and I just got a little Dixie cup so that just dip it in there. I and could scoop it up. Scoop up sludge, but water at the same time, so we can get a little watery. We'll do that one more time. Safe measures. And I'm gonna set that on top of the sludge. No, no, fill it all the way up. Oh. Whoa, I found even more shells. Ew, is that like a something inside that shell? Ew. <laughs> that, well, too bad. I took it home. <laughs> I'm playing with it and it's super fun, but I found shells. I'm not sure if there's stuff inside of it. Little animals? Yeah, hopefully I didn't steal their home. Okay, well now we're going to fill this with some water. Oops. Ooh. Making sure it doesn't spill because this is going to take a while. Let me stop there. When it gets equal to the other side. Is that about good? Yep. Okay. 
right, we are going to do the test now. So water's red, sludge is black. Now, we get these. We turn this on to 200. Yeah. Okay, right now, it's at nothing because it's touching a towel. Okay, now we're about to do the experiment. Do that, and do that. We're gonna see if it makes Whoa. energy. Whoa! Instantly. Whoa! Instantly, that made 152.1.0 point. Millivolts. Yeah, but well, it's just getting lower, but I don't care. Now, let's that do is this. so cool. Okay, here. Now plug this switch. water in. No, plug this, this air hose into right, that. Plug and let's this. aerate the water. Alright. And then plug it, plug that in. Okay. And we should see some bubbles in here. Oh, off the charts. It went off the charts. Had to go to the next level. All right, let's see. That is We're aerating crazy. the water because it should mix the hydrogen a little bit. That is crazy. I can't even believe this. My experiment worked! Woo! Okay, so turn off um, the water. Okay. Yeah, turn off the bubbles. Bubbles! And it's going down because it's less aerated. Alright, should I turn it back to. No, it's fine. Oops. Yeah, okay, it doesn't back. matter. And that goes down, 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 down. And I guess the lowest it will probably go is about. Let's activate these, like, like mix it up. All right, I'm gonna squeeze these a little bit. And look, off, the, off charts. the charts again. All right, here we go. Just kind of stirring it up, kind of activates the electrons. This is the. We have our little salt bridge. Which is kind of mixing it together. Look at there it goes. I'm gonna try something. So I'm gonna plug in the bubbles. And what I'm gonna do is while the bubbles are going, go ahead and mix it. I'm gonna mix it. See how high we can get. Yay, this is so cool. Turn off the um, bubbles. I think it's better without it, just because it's all powered by just biology. Wow, that is so cool. Now we know we might be able to actually and maybe even power something like a little mini light bulb with mud. And so that's my science fair project. And if you want to see something awesome, you should try it. Bye. We're just going to blow air into this little hose. We were averaging 0.21 volts. Now we're averaging like 0.17. I think the salt is going from the salt bridge into the water. Maybe if we replace the water here, it would go up. We're just blowing air into this little hose. That's it. No other wires connected. I mean, these look like they are, but they're not. Speakers. <laughs>